Good morning. Welcome to 49ers in 5, your daily update on everything happening with the team that you need to know. I'm Rob Stats Guerrero. Today is Monday, May 6th, 2024. Here's what's happening with your San Francisco 49ers. Does this team have an entitlement problem? Well, I didn't think so, but a couple former players seem to think so. It all began with a tweet from Willie Sneed, who, of course, spent the last two seasons bouncing between the 49ers practice squad and the active roster. He tweeted, quote, all I want is to go back to a team that isn't afraid to let guys compete for a roster spot. These last three years been nothing short of entitlement. Competition breeds champions. Now, that seemed really odd to me, considering the strength of the 49ers roster. So I quote tweeted it and I asked Willie, whose spot do you think you should have taken on the roster? He responded, quote, they can't give an undrafted 10 year vet that came in off a tryout workout a roster spot makes someone look bad. Now, in the meantime, another former 49ers wide receiver chimed in. That would be Ray Ray McLeod. He took to X as well and said, quote, God always come through. Finding your people make you realize there was nothing ever wrong with you. And look, Willie Sneed and Ray Ray McLeod certainly have more insight into the 49ers locker room than you, me, or anyone that hasn't played for the team has. But let's be honest, those two guys, not really that great. Willie Sneed's at the end of his career, and Ray Ray McLeod is basically just a return guy at this point. It's not surprising they didn't get a lot of looks for the 49ers. Now, do the Niners have an entitlement problem? Maybe. Should Danny Gray be on the team? You could argue no, and maybe that's who Willie Sneed was talking about. I don't know. But is there a real problem in the Niners locker room? I don't think so. More likely than not, Willie Sneed's just having trouble accepting the fact there's really no place for him in the NFL anymore. We always give you one thing to read, one thing to watch, and one thing you might have missed. One thing to read on this Monday, new 49ers safety Malik Mustafa grew up a 49ers fan for a very specific reason. Part of it has to do with the Madden video game and the fact that he grew up in a house full of Cowboys fans. If you want the full story, click the link in the description of this episode. One thing to watch, Fantasy Pros Thor Nystrom joined the Gold Standard Podcast Network yet again. He joined on Saturday to break down the draft class. He was extremely high on Ricky Pearsall. In fact, he said he would fight anyone that didn't like Ricky Pearsall. If you want to see the interview, it's in your audio podcast feed now. It's been up on the YouTube channel. Just go and check it out. Also, I will click a link in the description of this episode or put a link. I don't know why I said click. That was weird. One thing you may have missed more good news for D'Amico Ryans. He's got his quarterback of the future. He is building a very strong roster in Houston and to make it a little stronger because apparently JJ Watt is willing to come out of retirement to quote Watt at a charity softball game. I told D'Amico last year, I said, don't call unless you absolutely need it. But if you ever do call, I'll be there. Now, Watt said this is probably the last year that he's willing to do it, but that would be a fascinating addition if the Texans added a three-time defensive player of the year down the stretch and potentially for the playoffs. That's a wrap on today's 49ers and 5. Please rate, review, and follow the Gold Standard Podcast Network. Like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click the little bell so you get notified every single time we go live, which is every single weekday for you. I will be live today with Clayton Holloway of the NFL Network, 4.30 p.m. Pacific time. Vish had a personal commitment he needed to take care of, so Clayton's going to fill in for us. I'm sure he'll give us a couple of juicy nuggets, as he always does when he is in the chair. Enjoy the rest of your Monday, everybody. I'm Rob Stats Guerrera. We'll talk later today.